So Google Play Store is not available on Chrome OS Flex yet, but we can install a Linux App Store to easily access all the applications that are available. So let's see how to install it. So first we need to enable the Linux subsystem. So you can just uh, click on the uh, developer options and enable the, uh, the Linux from there. Now we need to open the Linux terminal and if you do not see the uh, the command terminal just open three to more tabs and quickly open two more tabs and you should see your uh, username and a space to type commands so the first command that we will type is the sudo apt update and then we can type uh, another command that is sudo apt upgrade so these are the basic commands that you need to run first time and now we can just uh, uh, in, like uh, run the installation command for the app store that is the sudo apt install plasma discover this will install the linux app store and uh, this is going to take a lot of time that may be up to 30 minutes so just let it run in the background And once it's done, do not open the application, run the sudo apt update command again and then only open the application. So under the app launcher, you can see under the Linux folder, we have the plasma discover application. You can just open it up and it may take some time before loading up and you will see all the different Linux applications. We have the Krita and Kitten Live lots of advanced Linux applications that are useful for all the developers but we can also find some basic ones that uh, are good for everyday use as well we have variety of video players and screen recorders audio players OBS studio and VLC and also Kodi Using this application makes it really easy to install the application with one click like we do in the Google Play Store or other app stores. So let me try and install this Caden Live which is a really popular video editor. So we can just click on the install and uh, it's giving us to uninstall some conflicting software so we can just proceed. And you can see on the left side is starting the download process and it will take some time of course and now it is done and we can launch it from here or uh, we can just go to the app store the app launcher and open up from there and it also has downloaded some additional KDE applications so it has launched really fast and uh, all the application options are working we can import the files but you see it did not show any video files because linux applications only read the linux file system so we actually need to copy and paste the video files inside the linux files that we see on the left side and now if we try to import it we can see our video file and now it has successfully imported we can also preview it and if you face any flickering or stuttering, you can simply disable the cross tiny GPU support from the Chrome flags and it should resolve the issue. And like Kiran Live, we can also install other applications like Blender and Krita, which are pretty high level application and take advantage of it. But it can still not replace the Google Play Store's huge library of Android games and applications but should act as a substitute in the meantime. So I hope you like this video and I'll see you in the next one.